hello viewers in the last video we are so how to run oracle form and report and in the previous video i saw how to install oracle forms and report today we will see generates an rdf report and how to make a call from apex that means i create a rdf report and call it from apex for that we will run the web logic server first yes here we will give username and password weblogic and username is weblogic123 then run note manager yes then we will run oracle report builder click on the rw builder I have two videos after Oracle form and reports installation and environment creation. If you haven't seen the videos, you must. Report builder run now. I will create a report. Create. Okay. Next. Next. Tabular. Next query builder here i will connect to the database connect after which object we want to generate the report i will select that object then click on the include which column from the object should be selected in the report okay next select all field for display next next finish we can see the report run now you will save this report file save as then save the file in the drive from my computer and file type is rdf here we will name a file i gave emp here and type is rdf save after saving the report i will run the web logic server enter localhost 7001 to run weblogic server console this address will run the weblogic server here we will give the username and password of the weblogic server which we provided during installation weblogic weblogic123 login for administration weblogic server we must run weblogic service otherwise web logic server cannot be run then click on the environment service control there are two service one for report builder and another for form builder since we are not dealing with form builder so we will only run the report builder service first check and click on the start yes the service will take a minute to run i say it again if our web logic service and node manager service are not running then web logic server will not run we can see the report builder server is running viewing the running status after starting the service go to our application that is we will go to the apex application form where we will call the report i will create a button when application arrives i name the button search run the button has been created now if i click on the button then my report is not supposed to run a url must be used to launch here we are getting a url 
लोकल होस्ट नाइन डबल जिरो टू नाइन डबल जिरो टू इज पोर्ट नम्बर अफ वेब लजिक सार्वर दैन रिपोर्ट और डब्ल्यू सार्वलेट दिस इज द कम्पोनेंट नेम यूजार आई डी हियर आई गिव एन यूजार नेम एंड पासवर्ड उथ डेटा बेज नेम हियर उल गिव द यूजार नेम एंड पासवर्ड अब दूजार फ्रम हुईच उल सी द रिपोर्ट then des format equal pdf des type this is referencing our file name then report they will give the location here we will give the location where we save the rdf report i save the report in the c drive emp.rdf first i will copy the path after copying i will copy the name of the report then i pasted it here i will copy this url after copying i will click on the search button click on the action redirect to url I will paste the URL in the meantime. Okay. Run. Now I click on the search button. We can see the report run. When click on the search button, turning on report within the application tab. If I click the button, the report will run in a separate tab. for that we have to write this code and i will paste the link of the report in single quotation copy the code and keep it in the url okay run now i click again we can say its report run in a separate tab 